Welcome to the Micromotion How-To Video Series. In this video, we will cover how to run and schedule the professional version of Smart Meter Verification, or SMV Professional, for a Micromotion Coriolis meter, using both the 5700 transmitter local display and ProLink software. The learning objectives are the following. Know how to complete a verification. Know where to find previous verification results. Know how to schedule and automate future verifications understand and export a verification report, and understand SMV diagnostics in ProLink Professional. For the complete set of configuration instructions, please refer to the appropriate Micromotion Transmitter Configuration and Use Manual, located on the Emerson website. There are many ways to access Smart Meter verification features in your transmitter. We will focus on using the local display of the 5700 transmitter to run and schedule smart meter verification. To run a verification through the 5700 display, first select Menu, Operations, Smart Meter Verification, Run SMV. To confirm the state of the outputs, select one of the following. Continue measuring fix at last measured value, or fix at fault. The most common selection is continue measuring to complete the verification without interrupting measurement or process control. After this selection is made, a 90 second meter verification takes place. If necessary, you can manually abort the verification at any time. The smart meter verification result is published after 90 seconds. If the verification fails, follow the prompts and run a second verification. If the second verification also fails, follow the prompt and contact Emerson Flow Support to resolve the potential meter performance issue. To view the last verification result from the main display, select Menu, Operations, Smart Meter Verification, Read SMV History. With SMV Professional, the previous verification runs date, time, and result are displayed here for your reference. To schedule verifications to periodically run, first select Menu, Operations, Smart Meter Verification, Schedule SMV. Hours to next run displays the amount of time in hours until the next scheduled verification will run. If the scheduler has not been configured, hours to next run will display a value of zero. Set hours to first run determines how long until the first scheduled verification will run. Use the up and down buttons to change each digit's value and the left and right arrows to select a digit. Decimal points are located between values of nine and zero. Hold the right button to confirm the hours value or hold the left button to cancel. Set hours between determines how often verifications will run after the first run. Use the arrow buttons to configure this value and when the correct value is set, hold the right button to confirm the hours value or hold the left button to cancel. The following features are available through ProLink Basic or Professional. For this section of the video, we navigate SMV with ProLink Basic. To complete a verification in ProLink, select Device Tools, Diagnostics, Meter Verification, Run Test. Enter any information you would like to be displayed in the verification report. The Configuration Details section highlights any changes to the transmitter's configuration or sensor zero since the last time a verification was run. Select Details for more information about any changes. Select the transmitter output behavior desired while SMV is running for 90 seconds. Because SMV can run without interrupting your process, most users select Continue Measuring to maintain measurement performance throughout the 90-second verification process. A live view of measurement data is available for reference throughout the verification process as well. To start the verification process, select Start and wait 90 seconds for the verification pass-fail result to be published. 
If the verification fails, follow the prompts and run a second verification. If the second verification also fails, contact Emerson Flow Support to resolve the potential meter performance issue. If the verification passes, select Next in order to complete the verification process. At this point, you can review the verification report, save and print the verification report, or export more advanced diagnostic data as a CSV file. Click Finish to complete the verification process. To view previous verification results in ProLink, select Device Tools, Diagnostics, Meter Verification, View Previous Test Results. With SMV Professional, verification run date, time, and result is displayed here for the last 20 verifications. Reports are available to view, export, and print for all previous verifications initiated with ProLink. To schedule verifications to periodically run, first select in ProLink Device Tools, Diagnostics, Meter Verification, Schedule Meter Verification. The input fields are the same as those on the local operator interface described earlier in this video. So far, all the features we've reviewed can be completed with ProLink Basic. The following features are available to users with SMV Professional on the 5700 and ProLink Professional. To upgrade to ProLink Professional, contact your Emerson sales representative for more information. Before we begin, it's worth mentioning that all the SMV features with ProLink Basic are also included in ProLink Professional. Once connected to your 5700, the Smart Meter Verification Overview screen will automatically appear. From here, you can understand and navigate your meter alerts. Verifications and process effect diagnostics. You can navigate by clicking on the individual icons or with the menu on the left. To return to the Smart Meter Verification Overview screen at any time, click Smart Meter Verification Overview along the bottom of the ProLink window. Clicking on Alerts displays all currently active or unacknowledged meter alerts categorized to Namur's NE107 standard. Click on an alert name to access actionable information about how to mitigate the alert. Acknowledge individual alerts or all visible alerts. Click on History to view information about the 20 most recent device alerts. Categorize this table by clicking on a column title. Click Save Alert History from Internal Memory to export a text file with information about all previous meter alerts. Clicking on Meter Verification displays detailed results from the most recent Smart Meter Verification run. From here, you can show the verification report if SMV was initiated through the ProLink interface, schedule future verifications, and run another verification. Click the History tab to view details from the previous 20 verifications, view and print reports, and export advanced diagnostic data as a CSV file. Clicking on Process Effects displays diagnostics about how your process may be affecting the performance of your Coriolis meter. Clicking on Flow Range displays a live one-minute graph of flow range data. If current data is within the optimum flow band, the flow rate through the meter is optimal and accurate for measurement, requiring no further action from the user. If current data is within the Verify Zero band, the user is encouraged to click on and run zero verification. Follow the recommendations of the Zero Verification tool to ensure optimal measurement performance. If current data is within the Flow Rate to Low band, there is likely no flow through the meter and no action is required. Click the History tab to display the same diagnostic bands for data from the past 24 hours. Clicking on Multiphase displays a live one-minute graph of multiphase data. If current data is within the single phase flow band, the phase of fluid flowing through your meter is optimal for accurate measurement. If current data is within the moderate two phase flow band, a small amount of entrained gas or mist is likely present in the process stream. Meter performance is usually acceptable under these conditions and typically no user action is required. 
To improve meter performance under moderate two-phase flow, increase flow rate and or pressure in the meter. If current data is within the severe two-phase flow band, severe gas or mist entrainment is preventing the meter from reaching ideal measurement accuracy. Users should increase flow rate and or pressure in the meter or contact their Emerson sales representative about advanced phase measurement, which can solve measurement challenges associated with two-phase flow. Click the History tab to display the same diagnostic bands for data from the past 24 hours. Previously reviewed features such as Smart Meter Verification Scheduler and Zero Verification are conveniently available after clicking on Tools. This concludes this video on how to run and schedule the professional version of Smart Meter Verification or SMV Professional for a Micromotion Coriolis meter using both the local display and ProLink software. You should now know the following. How to complete a verification. Where to find previous verification results. How to schedule and automate future verifications. Understand and export a verification report. And understand SMV diagnostics in ProLink Professional. For the complete set of configuration instructions, please refer to the appropriate Micromotion Transmitter Configuration and Use Manual located on the Emerson website.